Welcome everyone. The first step to access USB on your iPhone is you will need an adapter which converts your charging port, in my case Lightning. You may have a USB-C iPhone, then use USB-C and you want to convert that into USB type A. If your accessory is USB type C and your charging port is USB type C, then you can plug in the uh, accessory directly. But in my case, my accessory is USB type A. My charging port is a lightning. So we will need the adapter. And these are generic adapters. You can get them from Amazon for about $10, maybe less, but don't go too low. Otherwise the quality may be bad. So you're going to connect the cable into your iPhone and then you have the port here. And so you just need a USB device. So I have my SanDisk flash drive and I'm just going to connect this to the port right here. And once you've done that, to access your USB accessory, if it's a storage device, you're going to find and open the files app and then you're going to tap on browse until you're brought to this browse view and you should see a flash drive icon and then the name of your drive and you can tap into this and you should be able to access your files and if you want to move your files just tap on the dots, select select the files and then there should be another triple dot copy then you go to the drive you tap the triple dots again and there should be a paste option if you don't see it here you may need to long press on the empty space and then tap on paste instead if this drive is read only then that means you didn't format your hard drive for your iPhone. And I mean, how would you know how to do that, right? So what you need to do is just make sure that you have the XFAT uh, format on your drive. If you don't know how to do that, you can look it up. Or you could have Apple APFS. So if you don't know how to do that, again, you'll need to look that one up. And that does require access to a computer, so keep that one in mind. Some USB accessories also have a dedicated app, so you may need to just use an app instead of the files app. So let's say you have a SanDisk case, you will need to search up SanDisk. And then from here, you can see we have a app for this iXpand, and these are custom drives made for your iPhone and I believe they make cases which have like storage as well so with that being said if you'd like to help support the channel please do check the description bye bye